Hey, good morning. I'm Dan Brown. I'm an artist from Okanagan, Washington, and I used to be the art teacher at Okanagan Middle School and High School. Today we're going to look at some public art by Smoker Marchand, and the first piece we're going to look at today is at the Colville Tribal Trails gas station on Highway 97 between Okanagan and Omac. Okay, good morning. We're looking at this public artwork, and public art means it's art that is out there where everybody can come and take a look at it. Um, this piece is by Smoker Marchand. He's a Native American. He belongs to the Arrow Lakes Band, which one of, is one of the 12 bands of the Colville Confederated Tribes. And one of the cool things about Smoker Marchand, one of the many cool things, is he's a contemporary artist. And contemporary is just a big word that means he's living today. Unlike a lot of artists and art books, he is alive. And if you went to a store in OMAC, you might see him, or you could go out to his studio and you might see him there. There are a lot of ways to become an artist. And what Smoker did is he just started doodling. And his brother, who's a silversmith, noticed that his doodles were pretty good. So he and his mother helped Smoker apply um, to college. The college Smoker went to is the Institute of American Indian Arts in Santa Fe, New Mexico. And he mainly studied drawing and painting and printmaking there. When he graduated, he moved back to OMAC, got a job with the Colville Tribes where he's worked for 43 years. And so like a lot of artists, he does his work in the evenings and on weekends. And then about 30 years ago, he started working in metal. Um, and he's pretty much self-taught at that because he did not study that in school. After Smoker cuts out the pieces, he takes a grinder to make any rough parts smooth, and then he bends the shapes. He'll put this piece in an anvil, and he takes a great big hammer, and he just bends them the, the way that he wants them to go. Then the last step is he holds the metal together, and he welds it. And a, wel and a weld is just a, a you use a machine that melts the metal together and it forms a really strong joint. Smoker's art has three dimensions. It has form. And so that means parts stick out. It's just not a, a flat piece of metal. And it, it functions in a lot of different ways. Part of it, it gives his, his sculpture some strength, it makes it look more real, and then also it creates interesting cast shadows like this one here. It's so cool that right here in OMAC we have some more sculptures by Smoker Marchand. Um, here we're outside the OMAC Stampede Museum which is in the park by the swimming pool in OMAC. Um, take a look at these horses. They're pretty cool the way they're standing. And then look at the horse on the right. It has some holes cut in it. And most of the time, you think of holes as just being holes. But look at these. They all create interesting shapes of animals. Um, take a look and see if you can find out what animals he's included in these horses. Smoker has artwork all over Okanagan County and the Colville Reservation. I hope you go outside and enjoy the stunning sculptures in person.